Yes, I, I'm not sure that I personally played a part in the creation of it. I was at the first OHBM. Um, I, um, I actually gave the last talk at the first OHBM. I, I developed laryngitis, so I barely squeaked out my talk and then I didn't speak for about three days after that. Uh, but um, it was a very exciting time and it was a, it was a time of great and active discussion about um, uh, whether or not we should create an organization or whether this should just be an annual meeting. Mm -hmm. And it was a very controversial uh, topic. Um, others are, will be much better at speaking to you about that. It was um, amusing, actually. But, um, uh, but the truth was that uh, we really needed OHBM. Uh, before that, when we were, before fMRI, we were pet investigators, and the only meeting that really made sense for us to go to was cerebral blood flow and metabolism, because we were measuring, in fact, cerebral blood flow. So, uh, so we joined this meeting with all these other people who were studying basic mechanisms of, of um, blood flow and metabolism, mostly in, in, in animals. We used to call them the metabolists. And, and then there, were, there was this completely separate group of individuals at this meeting who were doing activation imaging and the metabolists had no idea what we were doing and we had no idea what they were doing. So it was really not much of a, of a, of a happy marriage. And so it, it was necessary to have a, another organization that, that really appreciated brain mapping per se, human brain mapping, the idea of, of, of relating brain function to brain structure. Um, so, uh, so many of us were involved, and it was Bernard, of course, who put together this first meeting, and um, and then a bunch of individuals, including Peter Fox and and um, uh, John Mazziota and uh, and uh, Alan Evans and uh, ma uh, many others, who um, uh, Richard Prokoviak, who pushed forward the idea that we should have at least a meeting, and maybe it should be an organization, and uh, now I think we're going to become a society. Mm -hmm. It was a very exciting time.